This is what you're going to need for the project. A 7 millimeter, 8 millimeter, and 10 millimeter socket, as well as an E12 external torque socket and a ratchet. Let's get to the project. What's up guys, I'm Matt from PSI Conversions and today I'm going to show you how to take the TCM out of the 6L80 transmissions. We've got this one flipped over so we can get some good shots for you. So first thing, we're going to go ahead and remove the pan. As well as the filter. And then you're down to the valve body itself. And what you need to do is remove these external E12 Torx bolts. There's six of them. There are six external Torx E12 sized that need to be removed to remove the valve body. So we're going to go ahead and remove those. Now that we've got those removed, we're going to go ahead and take the valve body out. You need to pull this white connector out. There's a little push pin on the front of it. And you want, when you reinstall, you want to make sure that the nub on this selector goes back into this black plastic housing. To, to remove this, you're just going to lift up on the front and pull forward and you want to make sure that these four seals stay in place. All right so now that it's removed from the transmission there are 11 bolts that hold the TCM to the valve body itself. There are five seven millimeters, four ten millimeters and then two eight millimeters on the top. So we're going to go ahead and remove those. So once you go ahead and remove the bolts, you undo this green connector, just slide the gray locking tab out, push the button, and there's one more connector underneath here. And now you're TCM is separate from your valve body. To send these in for tuning, you do not need to send the valve body. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope this helped you get your project wired up and fired up. Remember to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, leave us a comment with any questions or videos that you want to see in the future. If you need to speak to one of our experts, you can call us at this phone number or either one of these email addresses. We'll see you in the next video.